guys how are you all doing and hope you're all having a beautiful day this is just going to be a pick a card reading before the actual reading so you can skip to that if you don't want to watch the pick a card but anyways guys uh, here will be the timestamp for skipping the reading and skipping the pick a card reading and going directly to your reading now i will lay out the cards for the pick a card reading okay so so yes we have the three piles here the opal crystal ball pile number one red adventuring crystal ball the pile number two and the amethyst crystal ball pile number three so feel free to choose a pile and i will also be giving you the timestamps in the description or in the comments or if i'm not giving some of you please link the um description like link the timestamps in the comments and yes guys let us just start off with the reading start off with the pile number one okay pile number one how does this person think about you how do they feel about this relationship with you king of earth and the messenger of fire so this relationship is completely filled with a lot and lot and lot of emotions okay if you chose this pile your person's probably a scorpio cancer pisces or you are a scorpio cancer pisces or you are a aries leo sagittarius or a taurus virgo capricorn so these are the only signs that i can see here also an aquarius libra gemini okay give me any sign but the your person might definitely be an Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, okay? Or an also an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, Sagittarius. So I can see that this relationship is completely filled with a lot of passion. This person with a messenger, message of fire, messenger of fire, they want to give you a passionate message. They want to give you a passionate relationship that is going to last at least for several lifetimes. They, this person wants something that is forever. If not forever, they want something that is going to give them this amazing feeling because they're done dealing with things that are temporary that they don't want anything temporary anymore okay so that is the general message for from this person to you guys and if you want a personal reading make sure to contact me to my instagram the link of my instagram account is down in the description box below so bye guys now i will be moving on to the pile number two pile number two Pile number two with the red adventure. What is coming up, guys? Messenger of Earth, and we have four of Earth. Great. So, for the pile number two. If you and your person are dealing with a situation, definitely I can see here that this person is an earth sign. That is Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. It can be any of these signs. And you are also an earth sign. Definitely, if you're watching this reading. Okay, both of you want a relationship that is stable. But one person is not quite sure about this relationship, okay? They're not sure if they want stability with you. They're not sure if this is the relationship that they expected to have, okay? So this person has a lot of drama going on in their life. They're not quite sure if this is it. They're not quite sure if this is what they want with you. So there's a lot in this person's mind that they're not able to express to you guys. And you want a stable union with this person they want a stable union with you it's more or less a relationship that is going to be built on that is the major energy that i can get for you here guys with these cards you and this person are not sure about each other you don't know if this is it or this is not it okay so these are the energies that i can see here and that i feel here for you and this person guys especially so yes uh, thank you all so much for joining me here and 
I hope this reading helped you all. They also will come towards you giving you a message that is going to give you something stable, okay? So they will come with the documents of that new house that they bought or something that kind of makes you feel that you can trust this person and they are stable. So they want to prove their stability to you. That is also what I can see for you guys here. My lovely so chose the red aventurine and yes guys i will see you all tomorrow bye please continue to watch my love reading and my general reading for today okay so those of you who chose the amethyst pile number three so what is coming up for you guys let us find out King of Earth. We also have the Wheel of Fortune. So you want to rule things. You want to be the ruler, or this person wants to be the ruler. Okay, I can see here that they are very prideful when it comes to this energy. They're proud to have you. They're boasting about you. And they're making the whole story about themselves. They're very prideful when it comes to energies. All I can see is a lot of boasting, a lot of talking about you, boasting about you, and expressing the feelings of how they feel about you, what they're thinking about you, and everything that has to do with your energies. Okay, so that is what I can see here with this person. They're truly concerned about you, but they boast more than how much ever they're concerned about you so if they're concerned about you 10 percent they boast about you like 30 percent to the people around you okay around them definitely everybody knows about you in the environment every single soul that they're talking to everybody knows about you everybody knows where you are from what you're doing every single thing about you guys so yes that is the energy that I can feel for you here definitely with these cards and yes guys thank you all so much for joining me here and I will see you all tomorrow um, make sure to watch my general reading and if you clicked on to this reading you're dealing with a Taurus Virgo Capricorn it can be any sign but mostly you or your person has a lot of um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces in your shot. So yes guys, bye. See you all tomorrow. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, my lovely Aries. How are you all doing Aries? Hope you're all having a beautiful and a perfect day Aries. Let us see what is coming up for your general energies. Aries, what is coming up for you guys? General and love energies. For your general energies first, Aries. For your love energies. General energies and love energies. Aries, a lot is coming up for you guys a lot is happening in your situation Aries especially with this person I can see her that they are very obsessed when it comes to you and they were masking their feelings and they feel guilty for not letting you know their true self they are scared to be vulnerable with you they're scared to uh, be open to you they're scared to express their emotions to you because there is a lot going on in their life that they're not able to express they're not able to uh, talk to you about their life because they're, be they're going through a lot right now and even if they come towards you they feel like it's too long and too late to come towards you right now they're not sure if this relationship is going to be like the forever relationship because again they have a lot of doubts on you or on this relationship with you which is not really making them come towards you okay so that is the energy for today this person is never going to take any risk they're never going to take risk while coming towards you they're never going to be asking you things okay this person does love you they do care a lot for you 
but again you should know this okay they're not going to trust you completely until you prove them that you they can trust you okay because you've done a mistake once and this person does love you but they're not foolish enough to trust you okay they, they will forgive you but they will not trust you again so it's your turn to prove your trust aries to make this person completely yours okay so that is it aries and see you all tomorrow aries bye